Hey there guys, it's Omewrecker, and I'm playing Hearthstone once again, and this is a custom intro for this episode because the last one actually ran a little bit too long, so I cut it off and uh, took the third game from that episode that would normally be there and put it onto this one. So uh, we're going to jump right into where we left off, but I do want to point out that if you missed the previous episodes, be sure to check in the description. And also, uh, I do have a playlist on my YouTube channel that will take you through all of my Hearthstone videos, uh, including the... Uh, you know, the games that led up to this point here. Anyway, let's let this thing roll on. Okay, so... Here we, here we go again with... We, we got the Flame Tongue option. Uh, I kind of feel like I should... Well, so next turn we... I... Uh, this is tough. Um... Hmm. It might actually be a better decision to coin up to the Unbound Elemental. Because then that following turn, we could start using Overload. Hmm. But at the same time... No, we're, we're going to coin to Standard Totem. This will give us the Flame Tongue option. To take out his pesky little... Uh, I, I was actually hoping for a two health totem, but uh, this will have to do. X marks the spot. Okay, so uh, s screw that. We're going to go with the rock biter. Elements guide me. Okay, that's taken care of. And, uh... Instead of using the totem, we could always do a dire wolf and keep the totem hidden for now. Actually, no, we got a, we got a totem, unfortunately. Oh, but then, well, there's another one. Okay, that's taken care of. I would really like to wait till turn six to play this unbound. Next turn we could actually do a combo direwolf alpha plus flame tongue to get four attack out of that totem if we need it. Oh, I'm sorry, not four three. Oh. You shall not pass. Okay. Uh, I kind of feel like doing a lightning storm here. But that's going to hurt me bad. Uh, that means I'm going to have three mana the, the next turn. I mean, the alternative is I'd throw away a totem or I'd lava burst out. Lava Burst, though, I feel is better. This is an easy way to kill. Okay. Oh, God. Uh, here we go with the, the Shaman penalties. One of my least favorite parts of playing a Shaman. It's not like that spell's really much more powerful. I mean, it's got a lower mana cost, sure, but... Damn it. They changed that sound. Okay. So in this case, this is what makes the most sense. Fork lightning out. Okay, board clear. So we're still doing okay, but we still got these penalties. I mean, we got two more to come next turn. So we're, we're only going to have four mana available to us. And damn it, if we had had that unbound out, I mean, not that it would have been feasible, but think about how buff this dude would be right now. The nice thing is the Paladin is just burning through his cards. He has not been using his summon at all. Neither have we, though, to be fair. Greetings, friend. <laughs> Come on. Oh, Consecration. 
That's not cool, man. That's not cool. Oh, hey, Feral Spirits. Uh, again, I want to combo that, so... Watch him have Blessing of Kings or something to kill that. Oh, nope. Okay. So, Feral Spirits are gonna have to do their job without buffing anything. Oh, Bloodlust. Nice. Uh, okay. Let's make sure this is the right choice. I feel like it is. We could actually Feral and Lava Burst, um, which will buy us time. Yeah, let's do it. Let's buy some time. But that's gonna cost us four crystals next turn, so we're only we're only gonna have four to work with. But then again, comboing or comboing with the flame tongue is gonna be huge. But that penalty, man, that's gonna hurt. I mean, I'm partially I'm kinda hoping he plays something with seven attack. I mean the odds are pretty slim, but uh, that that could be amazing uh, for us. Reporting for duty. Okay. What is he up to? He's got all these one ones on the board. Does he have blessing of kings? If he does, he's probably going to use it on the shield. Hmm. You can't go for the Harrow Bozo. Okay. Move quickly. We could actually take this out. This is this is a two mana cost creature. Um Let's preserve it. That way we've we've got a taunt to play. So I'm happy with that. I would really like to see our Wind Fury about now. There's a Spirit Wolf. And we still got our Flame Tongue ready. Odds of winning this are decent. They really are. Although I do wonder, what it, what is he hesitating about when he's got nine mana? Does he have a hammer, maybe? Oh, he wants to copy my taunt. Interesting. Huh. Well, that feels like a huge waste. Reporting for duty. I feel he. I, I get the impression he's trying to set up. No, maybe not. Um. That what was is, a mistake. What is he up to? Does he have another Consecration? No. Okay. I wonder... I think he's hoping I'll kill it with the 5-4 to keep the taunt, uh, but I'm not gonna do that. Another round? No! Okay, so right now my goal is to go for Strength. We're gonna get out. Let's uh, check our totem. Hopefully healing totem. Oh, taunt. Okay. So we're taunted up. Um, Flame Tongue and Bloodlust is going to give us a ton of damage. Unless he's got some sort of crazy board con or board clear that I don't know about. Maybe he's got two Consecrations just sitting right now. If so, then that was a good bait. He might have two consecrations now that I think about it. Although he's gonna blow everything he's got to accomplish that. Follow the rule. Ah, Elder Peacekeeper, okay. Report 
So the question is, do we want to do a rushdown? If we do a rushdown... I think, given our situation... Uh, actually, wait, can we kill? I think we might be able to kill. Hold on. Another round. No, not yet. Close. Very close. Uh, we're gonna get card draw too. So he's pretty boned uh, at this point. I mean, good luck killing the Chillwind unless you got spells. He's got to punch through two taunts. <laughs> I mean, I, I feel bad for this guy. I, I've seen his name before. Uh, it sucks for him. I wonder. But I, I can't really see what he could do to, to win this. Oh, and it's weird how the, the Yeti doesn't show... Oh, maybe it's because he's still lower? But this shows a base value, not an increased value. I guess it's probably because he's lower in, in, in attack than he Let was before. I don't see how he's gonna stop taking that damage. I mean, there's just, there's just too many variables. Even if he kills the Yeti... <laughs> Consecration would only take things down to one. Although, then he could throw everything else at it. Uh, well, actually, yeah, if he consecrated, mm. he could take out almost everything. But no, he would still be in a really bad position. I th I'm pretty sure he would still lose. Okay, there's consecration. Okay, so let's test his theory. Does he have a way out of this? So he's probably going to attack the Yeti with the 3-1. No! Oh, he already attacked with the three one. Well played. Okay, we just won. My shield for Argon. I've got the beast in my sight. Let's see what we would have gotten. Another Our shock. Oh, might as well just use this. Victory. Ah, he doesn't want to let us. Well awesome. Okay. Well, hey, another win. I'll take that. So we're officially three two with uh, this deck. All right, so here we go. We're going up against uh, the Paladin, and we've immediately got our buff cards. Do I want two Flame Tongue Totems? Uh, you know, maybe. Against the Paladin, maybe. Uh, I think we can make this work. We'll see. We, we've got four Totems, right? We got four Flame Tongues that we can use to all buff each other up. Okay, so we have an Urshock. And that does not come with an overload penalty. That's good. Question is, is he going to blow his coin? Or does he have something to play? Hopefully not. I would really like to have the first creature out on the board. He's thinking. Mm. He's thinking. Nope. Perfect. That's perfect. Okay. Okay. Uh, so from here, we're going to test. Awesome, we got a taunt. So we can combo that with a flame tongue and make that a 2-2. Two -two. Okay. So he's probably thinking, oh, he can't do anything about this. So instead of playing the totem, we're actually going to play the wolf, dire wolf alpha. Holy shit, we got three of our four flame tongues already. Which is nice, because uh, we can actually pop a Flame Tongue next turn and make things really scary. If you play something big, if he coins up to uh, something with 4 health, for example, like an Ogre Magi, then uh, we could take it out. Oh! Consecration! Okay. Okay. Here what we get. All right. Yeah. 
Your magic shall not Oh, stay. silence. Damn it. Okay, so how do we want to address this? Um, we could do... Flame Tongue plus Cleric. We must cleanse the Sunwell. There we go. That's dealt with. And now we've got board control. Let's see, what do we want to do next here? That's the nice thing about the Flame Tongue Totems, is that you get to... Follow the rule. Oh shit. Well, it's still buff, I don't know what he's thinking. Okay, Forked Lightning, actually, um... Damn, if we had spell power, that would be huge. Uh... I wonder... Do I want that overload penalty? Let's, let's do a quick fish for spell power. Damn it. Okay. Um, I don't, we don't even need to use, uh, let's see. I'm pretty sure this will stack. What to do? Let's see if it does. Yep, it stacks. Okay. So we are going to do a quick uh, clear here. Time. Yeah, either way, it's the same result. Okay, so we're kind of relying on these totems to do all our work for us right now, uh, which is really scary. I'm sure he's really pissed off that he's got to deal with these totems. Question is, how is he going to deal with them? Oh, we need our ooze. Reporting for duty. Yeah, we really need our ooze right now. Please, Iron Jesus, please. Oh, God. Um. Let the pain speak to me. All right, do we want to take out the flame tongue? I think we do want to take out the flame tongue. Um, let's trade. I'll put it on your head. Job done. Okay, we're not gonna let him take that out. That's my thinking there. Unfortunately, we didn't get the ooze when we needed it, although we only have one in our entire deck. Oh, come on. We need this win. Oh, secret. Perfect. Okay, well, there that goes. Okay. Well, we don't have to worry about the secret. The gates are open. And he's got a taunt that's not strong enough uh, for me to knock it out. Um, shit. Actually, yeah, yeah, it is. Uh, we'll do a totem. Shit. Actually, no, it's not. Damn it. Oh, what was I thinking? For some reason, I thought that was three. We could fish for spell power. Let's try. Ooh. Okay. Um. Okay. I feel like I need to save the big game, Hunter. Bring the pain. We're gonna wait. I could always fork the lightning. 
if he plays something else. And we still got that Wind Fury option. Put this apple on your head. Okay. Ready for action. No! Please no, please no, please no, please no. Don't kill that taunt. Is he doing blessing? Get in there and fight, maggot! No! What? What the f What that the hell? Was a mistake. Join God me. damn it! Or both. What a crock of shit. He had a 25% chance. Please, yeah, please go for hero. Okay. Um, God damn it. We got a fish for spell power. Nope, heal. God damn it. Um, feel the power. Okay, we're giving him Wind Fury. <gasps> oh. Oh. Are you serious? Talk about luck. Oh my god. Wow, uh, did we just luck out or what? He lucked out, we lucked out. I'm perfectly fine with that. Wow. Holy shit. Yeah, that's gonna be tough to deal with. All dem shields. Okay, Ogre Magi will buff Forked Lightning. Okay, so we're going to pop this first. Okay, we're going to trade. Let's get out one of these. And hopefully uh, he's happy about that and he plays something huge. Okay. Where's that knife going? Okay. Secret. Alright. Uh, is he going to reduce something to one health? Okay, he's bringing it back. Oh, you son of a bitch! That little juggler, man. Um... No, you are- I'm sorry, you are not, uh, you are not staying in the game here. Okay, we're gonna- we're gonna save the big game hunter for one more turn. Cause it- I mean, it's- it's too at risk of a consecration. Okay. He really wants that totem dead. Alright, give me blood- OH! Oh, we got bloodlust. Uh... Oh, nice. Let's see, do we want to use that now? Let's see, what's, what's the advantage of using it now? We would have 9, um, 13... No, we wouldn't have enough, so let's do a quick trade here. Because of the risk of, uh, of blessing, I don't want to leave anything out. Uh, question is, what are the odds he's going to play a 7 attack? I, we need damage right now, so I'm going to get out the big game hunter. It's risky, but we need damage because we're going to try to go for kill soon. And we got Bloodlust anyway to, to assist us with any high health creature. 
Let's see, he's got 13 cards, I have 13, so there's still a decent number of cards left. Okay, there's his recruit. Why, why did he do that? That's weird. Okay. Oh, Fen. Fen will block some damage for us. Um, let's actually check. Okay, I'm just gonna start going for hero. Gotcha. This is gonna set us up to win. Unless uh, he could bone us hard with Consecration. Nope. Oh god, he's in trouble. I think we just won. Reporting for duty. Okay. Well. <laughs> we just won. GG. All right, so we are now 4-2, I believe so. Yep, 4-2, uh, so let's jump right into the next one. Oh man. Kind of fun. Um, I, I still think that Shaman is, is one of the weakest uh, classes in Arena, but I, again, this is entertaining for me. It's, it's something different, but I'm certainly not a pro. By any means at all. Alright. Paladin! I will fight with honor for Doomhammer. Okay, against a paladin, uh, we'll ditch the lava burst, we'll keep the lightning storm. We'll hold on to the flame tongues. Those served us well last time. Okay. Acolyte of pain, I'm happy with that. Please don't coin. Oh wait, I have the coin, duh. <laughs> a secret, really? A secret this early? Okay, so... We are gonna go and... Put him up. Hopefully I don't regret that. Because uh, his secret might be that whole diversion thing, or resurrect. Oh... That's why he played it. Um, I know what he's up to. He's he's gonna bring that thing back to life. Let's test it. Yep. Just as I predicted. So he gets two cards out of that. We have three flame tongues already. All right, that's gonna stall out some damage. Uh, if we can get our little silence attack, that'd be perfect right now. Yeah, that's a little bit scary. Oh, damn. Can we rely on this? If this does two damage, we're screwed. We gotta try. Please, Iron Jesus! Yes! Oh! Iron Jesus had our back. For once. Thank you, Iron Jesus. You are the best. I shall pray to you tonight. Okay, so we're screwed on mana. Uh, uh, okay, uh, hopefully something that can pop the shield. Perfect! Then we could Rockbiter it next turn. Holy shit! Uh, this is really going to hurt. Okay, do we have any other options? It's not strong enough to kill with the big game hunter. Uh, damn it. I mean, either way, we're, we're pretty boned here. Um, We have to do this, unfortunately. Okay. 
So should we make him choose between two flame tongues? I, I think we're better off doing this just strictly for the damage. Versus having another totem. We can't rely on taunts. So now we either way, he's gonna take two damage if he attacks. Question is, does he have a weapon? If he has a weapon, then he could clear one totem first. Oh, okay, Hammer Wrath. All right, so there, he's, there he goes. He just cleared two totems with no penalty, no damage taken at all. Okay. Oh, perfect. Shield. Well, uh... See what we get? Another 1-1. One, one. Great. Um, if I give it Taunt, that's not going to help us. Uh, so let's get out the Yeti. He's probably going to attack down the Yeti. Unless he's got spells or a weapon. Hero. Interesting. I still got 7 mana. Squire, attend me. Oh god, this is looking really, really bad. Not on my way. Oh my god, all these shields! Oh. God, this is horrible. Let the... Hey, speak to me. My seal for Argon. Do we want to pop shield? See if we pop shield. <sighs> if we pop shield, he's going to attack down. Hmm. Let's think about this. God, what I would do for lower cost creatures. Um, let's take out a creature. Blessing of Kings is a huge threat still. Attacking down a shield, just going to leave smaller creatures on a board who are going to attack anyway. Okay, so I predicted that one. Now the next one he's probably going to attack. Uh, he's probably going to leave his shield intact. Maybe do two Your for one for Nope. Okay, he's just going to silence. That was a really good silence, and that leaves me in a horrible position. Great. Um, he has uh, 12 damage. Reporting for 13. And I've got Lava Burst. Okay. Um... How are we going to fix this? What to do? Okay. I think I want to play Totem. And then Unbound and then uh, Lava Burst. Because this will let me take out a four, Into the breach. four easily. I got that guy too. Okay, so we bought ourselves maybe another turn here. He's got nine damage that he could apply to whatever he wants. Oh, God. Wind. Did we just... Wait, wait, wait. Did he have lethal and he just skipped it? I think he just skipped lethal. Uh, we're pretty boned. Uh... Tuh. Yep, that's game. 
I mean, uh, yeah, I can't, can't do anything with that. Can't do anything with that. That's it. Uh, so we'll give out a little well played, and we are going to concede, and that's the end of this run. Unfortunately, but hey, it was fun. All right, so let's see what we get. They've changed rewards a little bit. We went four three. And let's see what we've earned with our prize key. What? Well, hey, that's a lot more gold than I used to get. Um, 55 gold, 20 dust, one pack. Oh, good job. Feel free to try another run in the arena. You've saved enough gold. That's new. That animation, I think, was new, too. All right, so let's see. What do we get? We got uh, one rare. Pretty sure I have all of these. Um, Soul of the Forest is actually kind of cool. Slam is pretty good for the warrior. Let's check our collection really quick. We got um, we got an extra fire elemental, so that was one extra card for us. Let's go ahead and disenchant, and uh, we are pretty much done here. I uh, hope you guys though enjoy this video. Also, uh, I don't remember if I mentioned this at the start, uh, but I do have a video that I made. It's going to be a few back now that shows off the new legendaries uh, or the changes to legendaries including this elite torn chieftain really cool card you can watch me play it twice in play mode and uh, j seriously fun fun as hell card I'm not sure if it shows up in arena or not I would think so because I've seen Gelbin in arena I'm pretty sure but uh, yeah fun fun uh, card there and uh, also shows off the changes to uh, the hunters uh, king crush uh, let's see where's hunter where are you hunter there he is King Crush now has a new animation when he comes into the field, so I've got uh, I've got that in the video. And uh, Yasura, Yasura, let's search for Yasura. Um, Yasura as well now has a, a new animation when she summons, which is really cool. Uh, so yeah, good stuff. Hope you guys enjoyed this uh, video. Be sure that if you enjoyed it, to share this video with your friends and your communities. Obviously, more visibility and exposure on my Hearthstone series helps. Uh, keep this series alive and uh, running so uh, please do uh, you know again if you enjoyed the video please do be sure to do that and uh, that's it be sure to leave me feedback in the comments guys and thanks for watching i will see all of you guys next time